man, where did I park my car? are in public restrooms like people who use their feet to flush the toilet in a public restroom because they don't want to touch their handles on the toilet flushing mechanism or other people's poop stained hands have been but before people wash their hands their hands are just as poop stained and they handle the faucets but people won't hesitate to touch those they're like oh no problem they don't try to turn those on with their feet i mean you ever think about that no yeah me neither you doing still reading books haven't you ever heard of movies movies are the next big thing they're new they're cool they're fresh they're funky they're everything but i still like to read <laughs> you sad small stupid little man don't you know any book that has ever been any good has already been made into a movie thank you for telling me all about movies don't thank me. Thank Pooches, the ill-tempered cat. Hi, I'm David Dolehunt. I grind up corpses for the Mafia. That's right, see, I, I turn them into hamburger, and then I sneak them into grocery stores, and then I dispose of them in recycled packaging in the frozen meat section. And I'm here to tell you, reading is good. So go to your local library and read yourself a book. Knowledge can be fun. Hello? Hey, Brian. Hey, how are you? Um, I'm really glad you asked. I'm, uh... Okay, I guess. Alright, cool. Not easy being a driver for hire for drive-by shootings. Really pretty hard. It's a lot of work. Have to keep in shape. People are always trying to shoot you once the drive-by is over. Sometimes I have to bust a cap in somebody to keep them from smoking me. I shot a dozen people at the welfare office this morning, but it's okay. I have a permit for the gun. Oh, 
Okay, that's it. Seesaw? Seesaw? Yeah, seesaw. Sure, but not since I was a kid. Uh-huh. Why would I seesaw? Because it was kind of cool. Sure, but I can't see an adult doing it. What? I couldn't imagine a kid doing it. Seesawing? Seeing saw. What's this seesawing crap? Is that some new Ebonics thing? What's this mean, seeing saw? Uh, it used to be just called going on the seesaw. That's just silly. That's the way it's always been. Weird. Wait, how could you seesaw when you were a kid? Everybody goes to the seesaw when they're a kid. Everybody? Well, I guess not everybody. There's always going to be exceptions. And how old are you? 23. How could you seesaw when you were a kid? It's only two years old. What? The seesaw has always been around. That is some weird slang you got there. Is that some new emo thing? Emo? The point is, Saw just got released in 2004. What? Is Saw some new brand name Seesaw? No, you couldn't see Saw without it, obviously. Huh? This is getting bizarre. You could have just told me when I asked you, did you see Saw? You could have just told me no. But then I'd be lying. Well, did you see Saw? Yeah! Well, why didn't you say so in the first place? Well, I haven't done it in a while. It's not something I think about a lot. I guess I could see that. You see Saw too? I just told you that. What? Why would you ask did you see Saw 2? I just told you I went on the seesaw. Yeah, but what about 2? Yeah, go on the seesaw 2 as you call it. Are you nuts? No, I'm just trying to speak in your bizarre lingo. I have no idea what you're talking about. Look, if you didn't see Saw 2, all you had to say was I didn't see Saw 2. But it did. What? I just told you though. No, you didn't. I did! All you said was, I told you that when I asked. Right, because I already answered it. <laughs> but I hadn't asked it yet. But it's the first thing you asked. What? The first thing I asked was, did you see Saw? And I told you. I didn't ask you, did you see Saw 2 until much later. Why would you ask them? It's not like they're interchangeable. But it's the same question. 
Okay, I guess they're sort of similar, but saw and saw two are not the same thing. Is saw 2.0 some kind of brand new computer seesaw thing? What? It's the sequel. You just said you saw it. Saw what? Saw 2. Saw what 2? The second part of Saw. You mean the thing it bounces on? Well, there's supposed to be a Saw 3 soon, so I guess it would be the middle part. Saw 3? Look, all I asked was a simple question. And I gave you a simple answer. Forget it. Let's just drop it. Bye bye me. Did you ever see Princess Bride? Yeah, that's the one with the guy from Sonic, right? Yeah, he played the pirate dude in the black outfit. Yeah, Saw was a pretty good movie. I never did see Saw 2, though. But I think it was a pretty good movie. theater we used to manage? Uh, no. Oh. Ashley, what have I told you about eating cookies on a chair? It's not a f***ing cookie, it's a Fig Newton. Freddy Krueger, and I have a killing problem. I made it 60 days without killing anybody in their sleep, but then I realized I'm eating to fill the void. And I said, I'd rather be slim and kill people than to be fat and not kill people. Plus, people have a lot of misconceptions about me. It's not easy killing kids in their dreams. You gotta stay in shape. I broke a nail. Just pissed me off the other day. I got plenty of rest. The paperwork you would not believe. I need a salad or something. Does anybody got a tea around here? I don't know. No medical, no dental, nothing. You're on your own. It's so hard. I was taking that bike off the downtown bus and somebody said, are you a killer? Do you murder people? And I'm like, Maybe. And I busted a nail taking the bike off. And no one's ever been prosecuted for killing me. 
me. I've been killed nine times. And sure, usually I come back and I kill the people who killed me. But really, I think there's got to be some post, kind of post-mortem prosecution, you know? We've got to make it fair for both sides. And the bus driver came over and he was so nice. He was such a gentleman. I was going to freak out. But you know what he said to me? He said, let me just help you on your way. And I was like, it was nice. It was not, wouldn't, I mean, if more guys acted that way, wouldn't that be a happier place? I'd be so much better. And for all you kids who want to do what I do, kill people in their dreams, think about it. Think about it. People kill you all the time. They're running after you all the time. And then sometimes they call you names. So anyhow, he did. I know he did that because he, I was going to freak out. And he was going to have to call somebody from the bus line to come get me. And it was going to slow down his old route. But it was nice just the same. How was your day? And then you got your regular life. Okay, am I dating someone? Am I seeing something? Is my mother calling me? Is she bugging me about it? Am I seeing somebody? You know, all that stuff. Meow. Meow. You got to say, okay. Here's my home life, here's my me time, and here's what I do to, to, to get people, you know? And you know, you gotta go groceries, grocery shopping, all the normal stuff. You gotta work all that together and be happy. Be happy, that's one, that's number one. That's the first thing, be happy and everything else, you know, slowly work around that. That's what I do, that's what you should do. I'm Fred Krueger, and I approved this message. Oh, hey, Brian. Oh, hey, Dad. Hey. Hey. Yeah. Hey, how's it hanging? Pretty good. Yeah. 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 Don't get me started on those homies. We have to be listening to that rock and roll music all the time. They always gotta be tripping with that rock and roll music, get themselves up for the shooting. But they got the guns. They got the guns, so I usually do what they say. Hey, she's cute. doing my evil bidding, you know, killing off my enemies, summoning demons, and then one day, it's just gone. I mean, I don't know if it ran away, I don't know if it's dead, I don't know if it's been chimera-napped, I mean, it could be lying dead in a pool of chimera blood somewhere in the middle of nowhere right now, for all I know, and, and there's no way for me to be sure. I mean, I wish the captors would at least just take a picture of it and put it on the side of a milk carton so that I could look at it every morning when I eat cereal. I love cereal. What's the chimera? I wasn't talking to you. Hey, Ren. Yeah. Someone who hates women is called a misogynist, right? Mm hmm So what would you call someone who hates men? A misterogenist. <laughs> Get it? People think I'm a hothead. I resent that. The college kids actually love this trick. I can make smoke come out of other parts of my body, too. Hello. Hey. It's me. How are things? Never 
okay? <laughs> Who are we kidding? We're made for each other. We're two of a kind. We're peas in a pod. We're compatible. Take me back. Won't you take me back? Come on, we can work it out. Give it a shot. Give it a chance. What do you say? Come on, one more shot for old time's sake. Let's see if we can work this out. No. Oh. Well. I, I didn't really mean any of that stuff. I, I was just saying stuff. Um, yeah. So, whatever. Expect a call from my lawyer. Censored version of the Fig Newton sketch. Ashley, what have I told you about eating cookies on a chair? It's not a flarking cookie, it's a Fig Newton. your cell phone while pumping gas, you will explode. That is all. <laughs> 